All right, everybody. What is going on? It's about four in the afternoon. I've got something to show you. New sport, new boots. That's what I always say. And I haven't started a new sport in a very, very long time. So you know what? Today was all about buying some new boots. And I'll tell you what, I did. I, I, I was meant to get a haircut. Look what I did. I did nothing. I just got the sides and the back done. So the beard's still there. I went out today, I went out like with a mission, two missions, get a haircut, cut my beard off, or three missions, get a haircut, cut my beard off, and um, buy some new boots. And lo and behold, I got a haircut, I didn't cut my beard off, but I did buy some boots. And I'm about to show you them right now. So this is, this is pretty, you know, pretty, I don't know, it's pretty big for me, man. You guys, some of you guys might think, fuck, this is just a club training. I mean, if, if, if any of the guys from this team that I'm going to go and see tonight actually saw my vlogs and saw how excited I was about, you know, coming down to this football training, they, they must think, what the fuck's wrong with this guy? You know, we're just, we're just a club team in Melbourne, but the reality is, is that, man, I just, I just want to put that helmet on and, and run around so bad. I just want to be around coaches and other players so bad. And I still haven't done it, but it's going to happen tonight. Finally. So without further ado, I'd better show you guys my new boots. Now, everything happens for a reason, right? I went in there thinking, okay, I need something that's not too out there, but I need it to be out there and probably different than most other people's color of boots because of the fact that if you do something on the field, man, you want, you want the people on the side, the coaches, to be saying, oh, that guy. That guy in the red boots, that guy in the yellow boots, that guy in the pink boots. You know what I mean? Not that guy in the black boots or the white boots, because everyone's got those. And with that in mind, I'm really happy with, with the boots that I, I ended up choosing. I really am. I got some Adidas, what are they called? Adidas Nemesis. Adidas Nemesis 18.3. And this, this is what they look like. So we've got your classic Adidas blue with the white, the three stripes, we've got white sprigs. And um, we've also got this ankle piece that goes up on the inside of the ankle and goes down on the outside of the ankle. And the way that it fits on your foot, it's actually really hard to put on, but once you do get it on and once you do the laces up and this thing is around your ankle, it feels beautiful. It really does. Um, they're extremely light, you know, all boots are these days, you know, I went in there picking up different types of boots thinking, oh, this one's going to be lighter than the rest, but really the only boots that, would, that really struck me as being super, super light were a version of Nike Flyknits and they were around about $350 and you know what, I thought, okay, they feel absolutely amazing in my hand. Like even just feeling these right now, they're a lot heavier than what I felt, those ones in the shop. But the reality is, is that these were 130 and they were 350. So, nah, ain't gonna happen. Anyways guys, these are, these are my new football boots. So take a good look. They're gonna be with me for this year, this next year or this, this, this ride that we're on. Any football game, any football training, any kick that I make, I'm gonna be using these. I hope you guys have enjoyed. Literally two and a half hours until I step foot on my first ever football field, which is most likely a rugby field converted into a football field because that's what we've got to do here in Australia. But yeah, looking forward to it. So wish me luck. Guys, <laughs> if you were going to wish me luck at any point during this whole journey, do it now, please. I will take that with me and try and do something great. But really, I'm going to turn up there and just watch. Shake hands, say hello, and just watch. Take it all in. If I do see a drill or do, them doing something that I know I can do and I can, I can join in, I will. Um, and the other thing that I wanted to mention is the fact that in previous videos I'd said, and you guys have given me advice, to, to go down there and just say, look, put me wherever you want. Put me wherever you want. I don't care where I play. But guys, the reality is, is that the, the, the more I watch the game and the more I want to play, I still desperately want to be a running back. I do. I said it in the first moment that I ever knew what a running back was. I said it because I knew. I saw, the, I saw the style of play. I saw the things that they had to do on the field. 
and I could see myself doing that. So I still want to be a running back. So, um, you know, if I've got any chance at all to do that, I will. And I'm hoping that they see my athletic ability and say, you know what, fuck it. He's only down here for one week, let's throw him in. Give him a couple of handoffs, see what he can do. All right, I'm not even gonna ask you to like this video. You've probably liked it already if you are into this journey, but fuck man, we're about to bring it full circle. So I'll see you guys in the next video. I'll be sitting right here after training, telling you exactly how it went. I'll see you then. Peace out, everybody.